Empire Polar Grounds at the 2014 National Hockey Festival. This is the largest event in field hockey in the world and we have 220 teams participating and showcasing their talents. Anyone who is looking to do anything with field hockey definitely has to be at this tournament. Over Thanksgiving weekend and it's a huge recruiting tournament uh, for colleges and a big big hockey weekend. We have so many college scholarships throughout the nation involved in the sport that they uh, it's, a, it's a very serious competition for them. The other aspect is just pure enjoyment of the game and playing the game with other clubs from throughout the country. It started over 25 years ago um, as an adult tournament that has now morphed into a 250 team event um, with teams all over the world. Um, this year with a team from Australia featuring a gold medalist Brent Livermore. We uh, do a lot to grow the game, get people participating, boys and girls. Uh, we start when they're young with our fundamental field hockey program, uh, providing free equipment to elementary schools and boys and girls clubs. And then we get them here and then we get them playing recreationally as adults. So it's a lifelong sport. It's great for growing awareness, for getting people um, in the United States excited about field hockey, specifically in the Southern California region, um, which is one of our emerging areas. Oh, we love this venue. It's probably the number one venue for recruiting in the whole country. We get guaranteed weather, we get beautiful hotels, there's beautiful um, opportunities for our athletes to explore the valley outside of the hockey. The pitches and the, the Empire Polo Club are perfect. The courtesy and the, just the hospitality of the people here is just beyond reproach. The facility is just also beyond reproach and the weather is terrific. It's lovely, beautiful mountains all around and it's just got, got enough space for us.